Look at this big dividing line here. 60 in Youngstown, almost half that in Minneapolis. Well, that dividing line is going to cause some uh, stormy conditions here. Some rain, possibly some heavy rain. And then on the other side of it, you see the snow. And we're not going to have the rain until tomorrow, and we'll pinpoint that. Right now, ahead of that, we're getting some clouds, but the sun is just shining on through that. A lot of 60-degree readings here at noon, from Berlin Center to Beloit, Salem, Alliance, even into Newcastle and Hubbard, and at the airport in Trumbull County. And you see some upper 50s, too. So as we look at Future Tracker, I've queued it up here to Friday. And a little bit earlier this week, we had it raining earlier in the afternoon. Well, now Future Tracker has the rain holding off until about first news at 5 tomorrow and then into 6 o'clock as well. Then it rolls through the evening. And at first news at 11, Paul Wetzel is going to be telling you there's more rain. Now, there's not a lot of rain here, maybe about a tenth of an inch for uh, tomorrow. However, during the overnight, it looks like we get the heaviest rain, so there could be a quarter of an inch there. It continues into Saturday. You get some breaks there, and then it should be out of here by about 2 o'clock in the afternoon for another tenth of an inch of rain. So our weather team forecast for today, enjoy the sunshine and breezy conditions with a high of 60 tonight, partly to mostly cloudy skies, low of 47. Then for tomorrow, it's close to 64 high, and it's breezy as well. And we get the showers now holding off until close to 5 o'clock there. Saturday, showers come to an end in the morning for a mostly cloudy afternoon, high of 45. Yeah, and much cooler weekend there. Uh, just a slight chance of a shower on Sunday. And then here it is, last day of November, 47 and dry. First day of December is on the warm side, 50 degrees. But notice how the cold air makes its way in here for next Wednesday and Thursday.